Just, oh, we're just gonna walk in. Wait, talk. doesn't Robbie always ask if we're recording? We are. That's are true. Are we recording? I need to literally look. But you have, you're supposed to be walking backwards. I am. I'm <laughs> sure. Do we can do that. that. Alright, Robbie. What shoe do we have here? Asics Joe Nimbus 24. And how many is that from the Asics Nimbus? Gel 2000. Then. The Harry Potter. <laughs> the Harry Potter. Nimbus 2000. Yeah. 1974 Ooh. editions away. We're on our way. Quick math. We got it. Yeah, I have a degree from Hogwarts. Not a big obviously. Deal. All right. So <laughs> there's another mattress. <laughs> Dude, we need to do a mattress count on Believe in the Run videos. Should I lay down on it? <laughs> Sight. All right. I only got bed bugs, man. Yeah. Like I don't have bed bugs already. All right. All right so A6 Gel Nimbus 24. First thoughts. All right, first thoughts. Let's do it. Let's talk about what's amazing in this shoe. If you look closely, can you see that, Thomas? Flight Foam Blast Plus. Plus. Do you know what that is, Brandon? It's bouncier and more responsive than regular Flight Foam. It is, and so that's like their newest like foam, and it. this is the first time it's making an appearance in the Gel Nimbus 24, and I gotta tell you, this, I love it. Honestly, okay, so we're starting to see a trend where ASICS is starting to put Flight Foam Blast Plus, this new foam, into all of their, a lot of their shoes, not all their shoes. Um, and it seems pretty great. Yeah, so, right, so a lot of them have Flight Foam Blast. I think this is the first one plus. I think so. Yeah. Um, first we'll probably, one out. We'll probably see it in the future. First one out. But it's, obviously, it still has the gel, has this uh, AHAR rubber on the outsole. Nice coverage. Look at that. Very comfortable upper, but here's the and kick. Grippy. Here's the thing. This shoe lost almost an ounce of weight. Whew. Look at how light it is. Dude, it almost did blow away. <laughs> like All actually. Right. So, I mean, if anyone knows the Nimbus, the Nimbus has a long history of being not light. And yeah. of course, we have the Joe Nimbus light version, which is even lighter. Right. This. Nice recycled materials to that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but and this also has a recycled upper, by the way. And but th this is just the, w losing that almost ounce coming at like the ten ounce range. It it makes a difference. It it makes it a player in my eyes. Whereas before it was like a little too heavy, a little too clunky. Now that we've lost that weight, <laughs> where are you going? Now we're just doing circles. <laughs> oh, I now like this. Now we're going this way. That weight, and it's continued on with that nice stability. It's got the new foam in there. It's nice and stable. I think it's a really good shoe. So, first thoughts, you like this shoe? Yes, I ran in this shoe. I think I've done 10 miles in it. I think I did a six miler and a four miler, and I've actually liked it more than the light three. Okay. So. Yeah, uh, I have to say, as far as like a long miles, daily trainer type of thing, this shoe, I think, if, especially oh, yeah. if you've liked the Nimbus before, you're, mm -hmm. you're gonna love this. Uh, I was like always meh on the Nimbus, like I, I could do it with it, could do without it. This, I feel like I'm gonna be picking up like all the time. I did a 10 mile For run. Sure. First mile, first run this was 10 miles out of the box. Felt great. That 10 miles is ambitious for a first run in a shoe, so you had to have a lot of trust well, I going also, into it. I also ran on the Hoka Kiwana for 16 miles. And I, that sounds rough. <laughs> that was dumb. <laughs> um, so yeah, here we are. I'm excited about this. Technically, this isn't a full review, so we'll leave some, nope. some uh, breadcrumbs for the next full review. Definitely, but seems like good things. Yeah, so. anything else you want to say about this, Brandon? No, I think that's it, man. Who's Go the quarterback long. in this situation? Go long. Going long. Am I going long? Go long. Oh, that's a bad throw on my part. That's a bad throw on my part. Uh, let's try this again. All right, I get it. I'm not going to go down this way. If the wind's going this way, I'll carry it. Right, that's what it is. All right. You going deep? Oh my god, that was terrible. I, I, I need to drop the other shoe. Because I you tried to do it one hand. You didn't have your receiving gloves on either. 